Hey guys, it's Amos. So if you guys didn't know, I've lived in this house for my entire life. And I basically know it as well as the back of my own hand. My house is kind of a small one, which isn't great, but it does have its advantages. Like vacuuming, for example. Done! But we're not here to talk about why my house is a good one. Here are the reasons why my house ticks me off. Well, my house is a small one, which should already tell you a lot. But since you guys are probably here to listen to my fabulous voice, but more likely here because you have nothing better to do, I will personally explain to you why my house ticks me off. So, my house is so full of junk that there's barely any room left to store it. I'll find myself sitting on the table because there's too much stuff piled on the couch. I can't put anything down because if I do, I'll never see it again. Things don't get put away where they should, so I'll end up eating off of a book and trying to read a plate. And when we do clean up, we don't actually. We just take the junk and move it from one room to another and move it again when we need that room. When I use the front door, it jams because there's too much stuff on the floor. It's a puzzle trying to get my bike out of the garage. My house is so messy that I can hardly find a place to record. Like this set is basically the final frontier. Which actually works out nicely because I have a drum set and a green screen. Which means I can have some awesome spontaneous dance parties. <laughs> My family has this habit of buying massive amounts of secondhand junk. But the thing about the secondhand junk is, well, it's junk. Like, we have this old microwave that we picked off of a garage sale, and it's not exactly a thrill using it. We also have these cheap house ornaments that are who knows how old and from who knows where. And honestly, they're basically useless. All they do is collect dust. Why can't you two be like your cousin Vacuum over there? He collects dust for a living. What do you guys do? Sit around watching him work his butt off? Disgraceful. Anyway, my house is old, which means a lot of the stuff in it is old too. I think that some of the magnets that we have on our fridge haven't moved for years. And there are some jars that are legit stuck to the top of the cabinets. And there's this place behind my staircase where all of the oldest junk is. And I bet if I dug deep enough, I could find some ancient relics. Is that a flip phone? And don't even get me started on the attic upstairs. Who knows what I'll find up there. Whew. What is this thing? If you guys ever wonder why my name is Amos, just take a look at our house and you'll understand. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.